Identifying a chemical reaction in three experiments. A chemical reaction is a combination of two or more substances that creates a new substance. The reaction cannot be reversed to return to the two original substances. Experiment number one, oil and water. When oil is added to water, you can tell almost immediately that no chemical reaction is taking place. No matter how much it's stirred, the two substances just do not combine to form a new substance. Experiment number two, table salt and water. When salt is added to the water, it appears that a chemical reaction may have taken place. Neither the salt nor the water are the same substances as when we began the experiment. The true test to whether or not we've created a chemical reaction is to see if we can return the two substances to their original form. By heating the solution on the stove, we can cause the water to evaporate and thus leave only salt in the bottom of the pan. Therefore, a chemical reaction did not take place. Experiment number three, borax solution and white glue. A pretty surprising thing happens when you pour borax diluted in water into white glue. Borax is a pretty common household chemical. It's used for laundry and other cleaning jobs. You can see a pretty remarkable thing has happened. Neither the borax nor the glue looks the same as when we started. They have totally changed into a new substance. This is a perfect example of a chemical reaction.